What's up guys, I'm Casey with Tennessee Football. Obviously, we wish you guys could come on campus, but since you can't, we are bringing campus to you and we're starting here at the Torchbearer. Now the Torchbearer is one of the most iconic sculptures on campus and it embodies the ideals of the university, which is light the way. But what's significant about the Torchbearer, this is where you're gonna start the ball walk, another iconic Tennessee football tradition, one of the most exciting game day traditions. You're gonna get off the buses right here and you're gonna start here and walk down Peyton Manning Pass all the way to gate 21. So during the ball walk, you'll walk down through here, right in front of gate 21. You're gonna have fans on either side of you guys cheering you on giving you high fives. You're gonna have little kids wearing your jersey number and just wanting a picture with their favorite player. So once you get down here in front of the gates, you'll head in, go to the field. What's awesome about Neyland Stadium, it's right in the center of campus. So you're gonna see it everywhere you go. When you're walking to class, when you're going back to your dorm, you get to see this stadium every single day. And it's also really close to where you're gonna be taking a lot of your classes. Let's go check it out. Okay, so I hope you guys have been doing your cardio, not slacking off on your workouts because you're probably going to have to walk up all of these steps to go to some of your classes, especially in your first couple years taking gen ed classes. But this is how you get to the hill and the hill is one of the most iconic areas on campus because there are so many classes and also there's Ayers Hall. So now we are at the top of the hill in front of Ayers Hall. Ayers Hall is one of the most recognizable landmarks on campus, and it's also one of the oldest landmarks on campus. But hey, you might actually have some classes in here one day. Another thing that's cool about Ayers Hall, at the top of the brick, right under the clock, there's a checkerboard pattern, and that's where the checkerboard end zones came from. General Neeland, when he was the coach here, he used to tell his players, run to the checkerboards, because you could see them at the top of Ayers Hall, and if you ran to the checkerboard, Boards, that means you scored a touchdown. So Tennessee also has a state-of-the-art student union that houses career services, a pod market, different dining options, and it's also just a really great place to come to if you want to hang out with your friends or your teammates in between some of your classes. So now we're walking down a pedestrian walkway, and once you head down here, you will land in front of the library. The library is a place where you'll probably find yourself. It's where a lot of people meet for group projects, and you'll probably have a group project or two while you're in school. So the library, again, another great resource for you guys it's a place where you can come and study or come and meet up with your friends in between classes so now we are in front of the Thornton Center now this is the academic center so you're gonna spend a lot of time here studying you're also going to receive tutoring here because there's a ton of people that work here that are here just to help you succeed in the classroom they're also here to prepare you for life after football so whether that's playing four years here at Tennessee or even after your professional playing career so a block away where you're gonna be doing your studying over at the Thornton Center is where you'll be living over here at Stokely Hall let's go check it out all right, so now we're in front of Stokely Hall. This is where you're gonna be living your freshman year. It's also where a lot of other student athletes live. So you'll get an opportunity to meet some of your fellow Vols here. They also have other dining options here at Stokely Hall. And then you also have a really spacious dorm. You're gonna get your own bedroom. You've got a little lounge area for you and your roommate to hang out in. And then you've also got an area where you can leave snacks because I know y'all get hungry when you get done working out at the Anderson Training Complex, which is right by Stokely Hall. And that's where we're headed to next. Now we're headed into the Anderson Training Center where you're going to be spending most of your time. So this is where our indoor field is here. You're going to practice on this field. You're going to work out on this field like some of the guys behind me. This is also where you'll come to work out. There's a weight room here. There's Smokies. That is the dining hall that you'll go to to get majority of your meals. You'll also come here for treatment, meetings with your coaches. And this is also where you're going to build relationships with your teammates, your coaches, and you're going to have a lot of fun.